quaint little igloo we've got in here. Isn't that nice? And uh, I'm going to go in and go and have a coffee. So about the cup, uh, espresso drawn, uh, song shot cup. Cup on. Me go a chem mine. Me met go a light cup. Go a chem. Hold my cup. Café, San, Groom. Café, San, Groom, Jimmy. Groom, Quan Mai, Cap. Groom, Groom, Quan Mai. Groom, Dan. Good morning to you. Uh, it's Saturday on the 4th of June. 2022. It's around about 9.30 in the morning. I've come out to Mer Chok Luang. This is the reservoir up behind the 700-year stadium and there's a, a lovely area you can come to besides the water and overlook the peaceful ambience. Well this week Mer Chok Luang has been in the news. Not for how beautiful it is and how, you know, you can come here and just walk around and, and just feast on this beautiful, beautiful landscape in front of you, but apparently there are some huge fish here. And the irrigation department uh, have actually said, please come to this place and catch these huge fish because the fish are eating all the smaller fish and the variety is dropping off uh, obviously and the other fish don't stand a chance. Skaters on the top. There's thousands of them. A snakehead fish could help out eating all of them, couldn't they? All the way around the side there. all the way along. Well, you can see along the, the shore here, there are sticks poking out. They've got little lines on them. Little, little dragonfly on the end of that one. There's a little dragonfly on the end of that one as well. I did see the Facebook posts and I thought that'd be interesting to come and have a look, see, see if there are any fishermen here. That's exactly why we're here. <laughs> Good. I thought it would be crowded. <laughs> well, the only people here at the moment are people looking to see if there are any fishermen here. So just like me, I thought there'd be loads of people sat around catching fish. Now, there's the line going down there and Oh, there's an empty hook down there, look. Good Lord. So if I do that, you can see the empty hook bouncing up and down. Well, I guess in better times, these hard standings probably had little shelters on them, little salas, and people could come and sit and rest, have a meal, have a picnic or something. Apparently we can fish starting tomorrow. Not today. No, that's what the tide. Would you said. believe it? Yeah. <laughs> well, news hot off the press. I've just been talking to a, one of the uh, people that turned up here. Uh, he had his rod in the back of the car, and he uh, went back to the car to get his rod. And the, the, the sec security guy up at the gate here said. The fishing starts tomorrow, Sunday, so not today. So uh, the 4th of June, you can't fish. The 5th of June, you can fish apparently. <laughs> yeah, great. Good talk, Carb. One need that plan, mate. One need that plan, mate. 
ฮอลิเดย์เป็นวันหยุดวันหยุดพรุ่งนี้ได้ไหมพรุ่งนี้พรุ่งนี้ไม่ได้พรุ่งนี้วันหยุดครับวันจันทร์วันจันทร์วันจันทร์ได้ใช่ไหมวันจันทร์ได้ครับโอเควันที่หกนี่วันวันที่เจ็ดวันวันที่เจ็ดโอเค Wow, Cobb m a c a p Well, I've just confirmed with the gentleman here on guard at the gate. Today, <laughs> it's a long weekend. It's a public holiday, of course. Uh, you can't fish here on a public holiday. So today, Saturday, uh -uh. tomorrow, Sunday, uh -uh. you can come here Monday, Monday the seventh, one T jet, seventh onwards. When there's not a public holiday, you can come here and fish. So I'm glad we sorted that out, and uh, I hope to see you in the next video. Uh, take care. See you. Bye bye. Thank you.